just uh, doing vacuuming now. We've got a uh, new circuit, just all I've already done is just you can see the difference. All I've done is just doubled up on the uh, on the uh, the driver part. So to give it more power. Because what happened is that when I was probing on the gate, it was actually affecting the signal to the gate, such that the motor wasn't working, so obviously it was too weak. So now I'll put a, a second driver pair on there for higher gain and uh looks a bit better. But we still get like a, a slope. So we'll see. You can see it turning. I might be able to because it's quite dark in here. Okay. <coughs> uh -huh. And uh, wow, it's really dark in here, isn't it? Yeah, oh well. Uh, it is. I oh, just make like that. You can see. Maybe. I don't know. You can see a slope. Instead of what should be a sawtooth. Now that's on the gate input. Motor output does actually show switching reasonably well, but it's kind of holding in the middle, it's like a step. Okay, and the voltage is 10.66 volts. Oops. From the uh, bottom to top. Yep, so I'm just showing you that. There's no real difference, so I'm just doing an update. What I'm doing is I'll put the circuit there. You can see the four transistors. And then jump across to the gate. And now I've got my probe on the gate, and it is working. <coughs> yeah. Oh, and I've got the thermal cutout still on there. Let's show you. Might be able to see there. Okay.